dive into English swimwear vocabulary. Hello, language explorers. Today, we're going to make a splash with an exciting topic, swimwear. Get ready to dive deep into English language as we learn about different types of swimwear. Whether you're at a beach or a pool, these words will make your English speaking experience even more enjoyable. Let's start with some basics. Swimsuit. This is a general term for clothing designed for swimming. It's used for both men's and women's swimwear. Bikini. A two-piece swimsuit typically worn by women. It includes a bra top and a bottom that varies from full briefs to a thong. One piece also known as a bathing suit. This is a swimsuit that covers the torso and crotch in one garment. It's often preferred for activities that require a lot of movement. Trunks. These are the most common type of men's swimwear in North America. They look similar to shorts worn as casual wear. Board shorts. Longer than trunks, these are designed for water sports like surfing. They have a stiff waistband and usually a lace up front. Let's take it a step further and explore some more specific swimwear terms. Tankini. This is a type of women's swimwear that combines a tank top and a bikini bottom. Monokini. Essentially a bikini bottom with a connected strip of fabric to the top, leaving the sides of the torso exposed. Speedo. This term has become synonymous with men's brief style swimwear. Speedo is actually a brand name, but it's often used to refer to any tight, short swim shorts. Rash guard, a type of athletic shirt made of spandex, nylon, or polyester that's worn in water sports to protect against rashes from abrasion or sunburn. Swim cap, a cap worn to cover the hair when swimming. It's usually made of silicone, latex or lycra. And there we have it, friends. You've just learned some new English vocabulary related to swimwear. Next time you're at a pool or beach, you'll have plenty of new words to use. Remember, practice makes perfect, so don't hesitate to use these new terms in your conversations. Keep swimming in the ocean of English language learning. See you in our next video.